Hi, I'm Tudor Morgan. And I'm Helga Christiansen, and we are expedition leaders for Hurtigruten. Right now, I am standing on deck on our newest expedition ship, MS Fritjof Nansen. But where are you, Tudor? Due to the COVID situation right now, I'm home in Wales and can't travel anywhere. But I will still help you present our new fantastic expedition ship. I appreciate that. Where do you want us to begin then? How about starting where our guests first come on board, the reception area. Ta-da! And here I am in the reception area. Magical this movie making business, huh? Right here, you'll find our serviceable reception crew. The reception is open 24-7, so if you need anything at all, these nice people are ready to help you. And right here behind me, you'll find the onboard shop. This is where you can buy everything from suitable and natural fibre clothes that suits our expedition cruises to souvenirs and personal effects. There is also quite an impressive full height LED screen measuring 17.5 meters tall and 6.5 meters wide. This LED screen is an impressive sight. The cutting edge technology provides a resolution beyond 4K, ultra high definition, with perfect seamless and borderless display. After you have embarked, you usually go straight to your cabin to unpack and settle in. So why don't we have a look at the cabins, shall we? All cabins on board are outside cabins and they are decorated with modern Scandinavian design and natural materials. Some of our suites and bigger cabins have private balconies and some even have hot tubs. When you arrive, you'll get a wind and water resistant expedition jacket. That's yours to keep. You'll also get an aluminium water bottle and you'll find refill tanks with fresh and cold water all over the ship. By giving everyone their own bottle, we minimize the use of plastic, something you'll hear more about later. Let's start with the polar outside cabins. These are super comfortable and cozy cabins. They're situated on deck four and five. All of them have windows, chairs, a table, TV, bathroom with shower and a very, very comfortable double bed. In the showers, you'll see wall-mounted bottles with soap, shampoo and conditioner. They are there because we have a fleet-wide ban on single-use plastic. All over the ship, you'll see that we have done loads of measurements like this. But trust me, the content in these bottles are made of pure natural ingredients. The brand is called Arctic Pure. This is our Arctic Superior cabin. As you can see, they are very nice. They are situated on deck 4, 5, 7 and 8. Most of them have a private balcony. They also have chairs, windows, TV and a bathroom. You'll also find a kettle for making tea and coffee. All of them have double beds and some have an extra sofa bed to accommodate up to four persons. We have a green stay option for our guests where you simply hang a tag on your door. This means you'll use the same towel and bed sheets as the night before. This is a direct positive impact on energy, water and the use of detergent. Our expedition suites are extremely nice. They are situated on deck 7 through deck 9. They have large windows, lots of space and sitting areas, TV, bathrooms and double beds. Most of them have balconies and the corner suites that do have a balcony also have their own hot tub. Talk about comfort. You'll get your own bathrobe. There's a mini bar, kettle for tea and coffee and even an espresso maker. All this talking about cabins makes me hungry. Should we talk a bit about the food and the restaurants next? Yes, good idea. There are three restaurants on board, an explorer bar and a pool bar. Let's start with the main restaurant, Aune. Here you will get breakfast, lunch and dinner. Our chefs prepare wonderful breakfast and are ready to cook your eggs to order, flip an omelette and offer you a freshly baked buns and bread. For lunch and dinner, you'll enjoy three to five course dinners. This is restaurant Fredheim. Here you can meet and share experiences while enjoying some really good food throughout the day. The chefs make everything from cheeseburgers to sandwiches and they serve pastry and great coffee. Lindström is our fine dining a la carte restaurant. This is where you can treat your taste buds with a rotating menu of modern dishes that are inspired by the regions we explore, elegantly served and presented by our experienced staff. The wine list and service standards are impeccable. Dining at Lindström is included for sweet guests and optional for all other guests. I'd like to add, we offer full menus of vegan and vegetarian meals, as well as a range of new exciting plant-based alternatives. 
The Explorer Lounge and Bar is situated on deck 10. Here you can get a wide selection of beverages from non-alcoholic to drinks, beer, wine, liquors. This is the perfect place to enjoy a snack and a drink with a spectacular view to the landscape. We also have a nice pool bar outside on deck 10. What about talking about some brain food next? Ah, you mean the science centre? Well, here we are. This is the heart of the ship's scientific and educational activity. This is where you join the expedition team for interesting lectures, activities, citizen science projects and photo courses. This is the wet area and sample area, where we prepare and present samples. And this is our laboratory with state-of-the-art microscope. In this activity room, we host a variety of group activities. And this is our lecture hall, nice, huh? Here you can participate in in-depth lectures about history, wildlife, earth science, culture and destination-specific themes. We believe by having this onboard science program, we create environmental ambassadors amongst you, our guests. On every voyage, you can participate in lectures to learn more about topics ranging from climate change and ocean plastic to eco-efficiency measures you can take on board and when you return home. You can also make significant contributions to climate and environmental science by getting involved in our citizen science projects. Outside our science centre, we have our observation deck. Here you can join guided talks and observations. Because we often go to polar regions where it's a bit chilly sometimes, we have one indoor observation deck. And then up here, there's an outdoor observation deck as well. Then we have the expedition launch. This is your gateway whenever you go off the ship with the expedition team to explore the surrounding coastline and landscapes up close. Instead of complicated top deck deployment, we on board from a mid-level deck for better, safer and smoother deployment. Our sturdy explorer boats, kayaks and stand-up paddle boards are stored here too, ready for adventure. Let's move on to physical wellness. There are several places to work out on board. Firstly, this is the inside training room. Here you find high quality training equipment like rowing machines, treadmills, spinning bicycles, free weights, kettlebells and of course yoga mats. We also have a 150 meter running track on deck where you can jog and enjoy the view. The outdoor gym is where you can train using your own body weight as a tool. In warmer waters we offer yoga on deck as well. And then we have the wellness center and spa. This is where you can enjoy a variety of luxurious spa treatments ranging from scrubs and facials to massages and manicure and pedicure. Something for you, Tudor. I'm more of a sauna man, actually. And in the sauna, there are panoramic windows. Nothing is better than feeling my muscles relaxing from the heat whilst enjoying the views. To top it all, this is our pool deck. Here you can take a swim in the heated infinity pool or relax in one of the two hot tubs. A fun fact is that these pools are warmed from recovered heat from the engines. Yes, these ships are more than just nice design and super comfortable. Going to some of the most pristine and beautiful places on Earth, they are made with sustainability in mind. If you want to know more about that, please take a look at the movie Hybrid Ship Technology.